the Yankees reacted to the news of the resumed game by waiting as long as they could to schedule it in the hopes that the game might be forfeited instead. They also attempted some clever tricks to postpone the play of the game. For example, the Yankees announced that they would charge $2.50 for non-season ticket holders to attend the resumed game. This triggered lawsuits against the Yankees, and the Bronx Supreme Court ordered an injunction to keep the game from being replayed until the lawsuits were settled. The American League stepped in and appealed the injunction, which was overturned by the Supreme Court Appellate Division, which allowed the game to be resumed. The Royals were actually flying to New York as all these lawsuits were happening, and they didn't know if they'd be able to play the game until they landed in New York Airport. The Yankees eventually agreed to allow fans to attend the resumed game with no additional cost if they had a ticket stub from the July 24th game. 